Good morning, grade six. Good morning, my friend. I miss you so much. And I hope you enjoy our lesson today. It will be the solution of equation. Our lesson today is solution of equation. This is in chapter seven, lesson two in chapter seven. Our homework today is will be page number 539 and 541 in macro health. Our objective today is to know that. I need you to understand the meaning of solution of equation by a new method. This one is will be the inverse operation. And number two, I need you to be able to solve any equation by the inverse operation. First thing we start our lesson will use a small revision about the previous lesson. If he gives me 12 minus x is equal to 8, 12 minus x is equal to 8. How I can find the value of x here. And he gives me the value of x maybe 2 or 4 or 6. We will remove x and we'll make substitution by 2 first. So I will remove x and substitution by 2. So I have here 12 minus 2. 12 minus 2 is equal to what? 12 minus 2. This one is going to be equal to 10. 12 minus 2 is equal to 10. Is 10 like 8? No. 10 not equal to 8. So 10 not equal to 8, yes. So x not equal to 2. So x here is not equal to 2. Again, I will remove x and I will put 2. I will remove x and I will put 2. So 12 minus 2 is equal what? 12 minus 2 is to be equal to 10. 10 is not equal to 8. So there will be not the solutions. After that, I will use the second number. The second number here is what, my friend? The second number I will remove. Two and use the second number. The second number here is 4. So I will make 12 minus 4. 12 minus 4. This one is will be equal what? This one is will be equal 8. Is 8 equal to 8, my friend? Yes. 8 is equal to 8. So our solution in this case is will be what? It will be 4. So I will substitute it. One time by 2. The second time by 4. The third time, I will substitute it with 6. So we'll make 12 minus 6. You said for me, mister, I have the answer is right. It will be that x is equal to 4. I know that, but we need to check the third number. We must make the three numbers. If he gives me three numbers, I must move over all of them. Substitute with all of them. We have 12 minus 6. 12 minus 6 equal to 6. 12 minus 6 here is equal to 6. Is 6 equal to 8? Is 6 is equal to 8? No. So this one is going to be wrong. So it will be not satisfied the equation. This one not satisfied the equation. So this one is going to be wrong. The second example. The second example. You will make what my friend again? You will substitute it with each number. You will substitute it with each number. So we will substitute firstly by 7. So we will remove this y and substitute it with 7. Remove y and substitute in its place by 7. So we will use 7 plus 7. 7 plus 7 equal to what? Equal to 14. Is 14 equal to 15? No. 14 not equal to 15. So this answer is wrong. The second one, I will use 8. So we will substitute it with 8. 7 plus 8 equal to what? Equal to 15. I will use 7 plus 8. 7 plus 8 equals what, my friend? Equal to 15. And 15 is equal to the answer. The answer here is going to be 15 itself. So the two are same. So I had the balance scale of that. This would be R equal. So the solution set is going to be right. And the answer here is going to be 8. But I need to check the third number. The third number here is 9. So we'll make 7 plus 9 is equal to what? 7 plus 9 is equal to 16. Is 16, my friend, is equal to 15? No. So this one is going to be wrong. This one doesn't satisfy the equation. So the only number which satisfy the equation here is going to be 8. Why? Because if I will make substitution with 7 plus 8, it make it right. It makes 7 plus 8 equal to 15. So the number of the solution must make that. If I substitute in the equation, it satisfies it. We need now to solve the equation mentally. I need to solve this equation mentally. 
He gives me 25 equal J minus 4. Try to think in by your mind, my friend. What is the number? I put it here to make it minus 4. He gives me 25. What? Minus 4, give me 25. Excellent. I listen to the answer from 1. It will be that. He answered me, it will be 29. How I can solve by easy way? I will make this one. Here we have minus 4. Remove it and put here plus 4. So I will remove this number here, minus 4, and make it here plus 4. So 29 minus 4 it equals what? Equal to 25. Again, I will put here 29 minus 4, 29 minus 4 equal 25. How I make this, my friend? I will make that. Remove this number from here and add it in the other direction by plus. I will make it plus this one. Here I have 99 plus t is equal to 124. I need you to think in by your mind. I will give you one minute thinking about that. What is the number? If I make it plus 99, it gives me 144, my friend. Look carefully to this question. What is the number? I add it to 99, it gives me 124. Excellent. I will make what? I will remove this number from here, 99, and make it minus 99. So, I will make in the other direction minus 99. So, I will subtract. 4 minus 9 can. We will go to 1, it will be 14, and this one is 1. 14 minus 9 equals what? 14 minus 9 equals 5. Here we have 1, becomes 11. 11 minus 9 equals 2. So the answer here is, will be equal what? To be 25. So t here is equal to 25. So if I make 99 plus 25, this one gives me the right answer. Thank you, great. Our lesson today, my friend, is we'll be talking about what group with me now? Firstly, I need the essential question. The essential question said, how do you determine if two numbers or expression are equal? I need to know that. What is the relation if the numbers or the expressions are equal? What we need to learn today, my friend? We need to learn that. Firstly, to solve the addition equation by using the models and using the subtraction property of equality. Okay? The vocabulary of the lesson of today, the vocabulary is will be what? It will be the inverse operation and the subtraction property of equality. Again, our vocab of today is will be the inverse uh, operation and will subtraction property of equality. Look with me to this example. I have 8 equal x plus 3. 8 equal x plus 3. I need to solve the equation and I need to check that. Firstly, what we make? We will use the model. How we use the model? Look with me, please. We will make that. I will make here, I have 8, 8 of the shapes equal to cup plus 3. Cup plus 3. What we will do in this case? Look with me, my friend. We will remove 3 from the left and 3 from the right. Have? Good. I will make that. Remove 3 from the left and remove 3 from the right. We will do that. We will remove 3 from here and 3 from here. We will cancel this with this. Cancel this with this. What is the remainder? I have the cup is equal to what? The cup is equal to 5. Again, my friend, what we do from the first? I have here that he said. We have here 8 is equal to cup plus 3. 8 equal cup plus 3. How I cancel this? I will remove 3 from each side. Remove 3 from here and remove 3 from here. So the cup is equal to what? So the cup here is equal to 5. I have here the both cup and 5 is with the RB. So the two sides are equal y because the cup equal to the 5 because I move 3 from the left and 3 from the right. So if I will remove 3 from the left and 3 from the right by this shape, look what we do again. Look to the previous. 
Look to the previous. I have here that. I have three from the left. Go with three from the right. Look. Again, what we do? We will remove three from the left. With three from the right. So I have five containers. Remaining here is equal to the cup. If you remove three from here. Three from here done by this way. So I have the cup is equal to five. So we use this method to find the solutions. We can solve it by another way. It's very easy. And this one will get the value of that all the time. If I have x plus 3 is equal to 8, I have that, the two sides equal x plus 3 and 8 are I can solve this, look with me. I will subtract 3 from the both sides. Again, what we do, here we have 3, right? If I have here 3, I will subtract 3 from the both sides. If I have here 5, I will subtract 5 from the both sides. If I have here 7, I will subtract 7 from the both sides. According to this number, According to this, look with me carefully, please. I have here one, I have here three, right? X plus three. So I do the opposite. Here plus, I will make minus three minus three. So if you have plus, minus minus. If you have plus, minus minus. Minus from the both parts, okay? If you have plus, minus minus. If you have plus, minus minus. Minus from the both parts. After that, my friend, what we will do? Do? We will make subtraction from the both parts, three or the so x series will be equal what? x series equal to 5. Again, my friend, what we do? Look with me. I have x plus 3 is equal to 8. I doesn't play with uh, bowls and cups like here. I will make easy way. I will make minus 3 from the both sides. We will make minus 3 from the both sides. So x plus 3 equal to 8. Minus 3, minus 3. So x series equal to 5. So if I need to check the answer, what will my I will remove x here and put 5. Look. I will remove x and put 5. So, 5 plus 3 is equal what? Equal 8. Is 8 equal to 8? Yes. So, I check my answer and my answer is right. Again, my friend, I will make what? I will make that. I will make x plus 3 is equal to 8. x plus 3 is equal to 8. So, I will add here 5 plus 3 because I remove x and put number. The number is will be 5. So 5 plus 3 is equal to 8. Is 8 equal to 8? Yes. So I check my answer. So the solution is will be 5 as we said. Another example, he gives me what? He gives me that I have x plus 4, x plus 4 equal to 5. I can solve that and check that. Look with me carefully. I have x plus 4, my friend is equal to 5. I need to cancel this one. And this one is plus. So what will make my friend? I will do the opposite. What is the opposite? The opposite is will be minus. Minus 4 from this side, minus 4 here. We'll make minus 4 from the both sides. Okay? Minus 4 from the both sides. Here, we have 4 inside x, right? x side, that we have 4. So we'll make minus 4 from the both sides. After that, what will I make? Cancel this one. So x here is equal to what? 5 minus 4. 5 minus 4. So 4 here is to be cancelled with 4. This will cancel the cube. So we have here 5 minus 4. I will make these two together. So x here is equal to what? x here is equal to 5 minus 4 equal to 1. Again, my friend. The equation said what? x plus 4 equal to 5. So we'll make minus 4 from the both sides. Minus 4 from the both sides. So, x series equal 5 minus 4. 5 minus 4, so x series will be equal 1. I need to check my answer. Look with me what will do. I will have this equation x plus 4 equal to 5, right? Remove x and substitute it by 1. We will make what? Substitution. Again, the word is will be called by what? Substitution. Substitution. Substitution about x by 1. 1 plus 4 equals what? Equal 5, right? Is 5 equal to this? I need to ask, if this two are equal, yes. So my check is right. And the solution set, solution set is would be what? It would be 1. The solution set in this case is would be 1. Again, my friend, what we do? I will make that first to solve the equation. Add, make minus 4, because he make plus 4, I will make minus, subtract 4 from the both sides. So if he gives me plus 4, I will make minus 4 from the both sides. After that, I will have x is equal to 1. 
If I need to check the answer, we will remove the value of x and we will substitute it by 1. If I need to remove the value, that x, remove it and put 1. 1 plus 4 equals 5, so the both sides are equal and I solve my equation. So, look with me, what we do? You solve the equation by 1. Another example, if he gives me another equation by this shape, I have that x plus 2 is equal to 3 x plus 2 is equal to 3 and I need to solve this equation how we can make this x plus 2 equal to 3 I will make minus 2 minus 2 I will subtract 2 from the both sides so if I will subtract 2 from the both sides by this shape what we have my friend I have x here is equal to 1 another example we don't uh, look to the where the problem we need to concentrate over the equation itself. Okay. Look me to this example. He gives me what I have x plus 3, x plus 3 equal to 5. The first one. How I can solve this equation? x plus 3 equal to 5. Do with me. I will need to cancel this 3. This 3 is plus. So we'll make here look carefully. Because we have here plus 3 or plus 3. We will make minus 3 here and minus 3 there. We will make minus 3 from the both sides. Okay? We will make minus 3 from the both sides. So, both of 3 for plus 3 and minus 3 will be cancelled together. Plus 3 and minus 3 cancel together. Again, x plus 3 equal 5. Make minus 3 here and minus 3 there. So, x here becomes a low one. And we have here what? We have 5 minus 3. We have 5 minus 3. 5 minus 3 is equal what? Equal 2. So x series will be equal what? Equal 2. Again, my friend, I have x plus 3 equal to 5. I will make minus 3 from the both sides. Make minus 3 from the both sides. So I have x is equal 5 minus 3. 5 minus 3 is will be equal what? 5 minus 3 is equal to 2. So the value of x series is equal to 2. I need to make a check. How I can make check for this? To make a check here, remove x and put 2. I have x plus 3 equal to 5, right? I will remove x and put 2. So I have here that 2 plus 3 here. Look, 2 plus 3 equals what? Equal 5. If these two are equal, yes. 5 here and we have here 5. So the two are equal, yes. So I check my answer and the answer is would be 2. The second one. I have x plus 2 is equal to 7. x plus 2 is equal to 7. I will give you one minute to think about that. How I can solve in this equation? x then, I will make what? Hmm. x then, tell me, I will make that. Minus 2 here, minus 2. Minus 2 from the both sides. So we will subtract 2 from the both sides. We will subtract 2 from the both sides. So, minus 2 and plus 2 is will be cancelled. We'll subtract 2 from both sides, so minus 1 plus 2 cancel together. So I have here what? I have x is equal 7 minus 2. 7 minus 2 is equal what? 7 minus 2 is equal 5. So the value of x is will be equal what? 7 minus 2 is equal 5. So the value of x is equal 5. Again, my friend, I have x plus 2 equal to 7. x plus 2 is equal to 7. Make minus 2 from the both sides. We'll make minus 2 from the both sides. So I have here x is equal 7 minus 2. 7 minus 2 is equal 1, equal 5. So the value of x is equal 5. Here we have x minus 2 equal to 7. How I can solve this? Look with me. Here we have the minus of the same example. So we have here minus. So we will do the opposite. Make here plus 2 and make here plus 2. Add 2 for, for the both sides. We will make what again? We will add 2 for the both sides. Okay, my friend? So, plus 2 and minus 2 cancel together. I will cancel plus 2 and minus 2 together. Plus 2 and minus 2 cancel together. So, I add this number by the opposite side. So, x series will be equal what? 7 plus 2. 7 plus 2 is equal what? So, x series is equal to 1. If I need to check my answer, what we will do? We will check the answer here by removing x and put 9. Check the answer. We have here x minus 2 equal to 7, right? We will remove x and put 9. 
9 minus 2 equal what? Equal 7. So the whole files is going to be equal 7 and they are. Here in this example, I have x minus 3, x minus 3 equal to 5. How I can solve this example? Look with me. Because here we have minus 3. So we will make what? I will make that. Here x minus 3 equal to 5. I will add here 3 and I will add here 3. We will add for the both sides 3. So x series will be equal what? x series equal, this cancel with this right, equal 5 plus 3. If I have 5 plus 3, what we have? So x series equal to 8. If I need to check my answer, what we will do? We will remove x here and do 8. So I have 8 minus what? 8 minus 3 equal to 5. If that 2 are equal, I need to check that. 8 minus 3 equals what? 5. And here we have what? We have 5. And the both are what? Are equal. So if you have the two sides in the check are equal, so you are solving this one is right. So again, my friend, what we do? If I have plus, I will make minus on the both sides. If I have minus, I will make plus on the both sides. Check the difference between these two. Here we have plus, right? What we do? We will make minus on the both sides. Here we have minus. What we will do? We will add for the both sides. Okay? Thank you for your time, grade 6, and enjoy this lesson. It's a wonderful lesson. I hope that you are a good uh, health today and uh, have a smile. And I miss you all because you are an amazing student and you are fabulous. So I hope I see you in the next time by good health and take care about your health. Thank you for your time.